Welcome back to Predicting the NFL with Mickey G. It is Super Bowl time, which is the best. Uh, because, you know, we get to see the Patriots, um, the Rams. Uh, but first, let's recap. The Saints got hosed, but there's also not just uh, the big helmet to helmet not called pass interference play. There's some other ones too, but overall... The, the refereeing was not the best. Officiating was not the best. Um, and the same goes for the other game, the Patriots-Chiefs. There was the uh, phantom, you know, roughing the passer. The dude basically just went. And then they're like, he touched the Brady. And they had a mental breakdown and called a penalty, which then set up touchdowns and such. Um, so neither of the games had very good officiating, but that's what we've seen throughout the entire season, um, which is why we need to be like Canada, and you can challenge penalties, which they're thinking of doing, so that's good stuff. Um, but besides that, I mean, the Super Bowl, um, I don't really want to talk about the other games anymore, because both of them kind of triggered me, because one, the Patriots won, the other one, Saints got hosed. But anyways, Super Bowl... Patriots, they aren't the best they've been in the wild, but they're still the Patriots. The Rams, on the other hand, Sean McVay has gotten himself here. And did you know he's very young? He's a quite young guy, you know, to be a head coach in the NFL. Amazing. Um, but basically, everyone's looking at about Sean McVay, you know, Sprout House, the Patriots, again. Um, so I feel like I, I'm not going to pick the Patriots because I can't pick the Patriots. I, I can't do it. I don't think they deserve to be in this game in the first place. So I can't pick them to win kind of a thing. So I'm going with the Rams. Even though I really would rather neither of these teams to be in it in the first place. But I don't make the rules. I just predict the games. Put that on a t-shirt. Um, but, I mean, that's all I really got for you, y'all. And uh, the best part about the Super Bowl this year is Tony Romo. That's right. Tony Romo is going to be the announcer or one of them uh, for the game, which is exactly what everybody wanted, um, or at least all the intelligent actual football watchers wanted. Um, so that's half the reason why I'm watching the Super Bowl. The other half is the commercials. You know, I got to stay up to date. You know, I got to know all the memes that are going to come out of it. Um, so Tony Romo, the commercials, two pluses, uh, Patriots Super Bowl. A minus, um, so we only have one plus at this point. And so one out of three things is making me watch Super Bowl this year. And I'll probably get food or something. So well, that's all I've really got for you all today. So uh, adios.